so I'm out in the woods today. I'm going to do a review on a product uh, that the Friendly Swede sent me. It is their uh, uh, paracord bracelet that is uh, contains a fire steel a scraper knife and you twine over the normal components of a paracord bracelet i.e. paracord so uh, anyway to uh, so to raw there got spooked by me <laughs> so uh, I'm gonna find a spot and uh, collect my materials and uh, make a fire and talk some more about it I saw a raw deer and uh, see him. It can be somewhat damp as there is a big surface to them, so uh, make sure to pick the highest leaves, uh, they are more, more exposed to the wind. And of course don't pick anything that resembles green. Which I did. <laughs> I also picked up some um, <laughs> seed parts from uh, thistles, they might come in handy. <laughs> Got some on this side too. <laughs> Tinder on the go. Anyway, um, so the bracelet is adjustable by this toggle uh, fire steel and uh, it is uh, Really nice piece of kit. I'm gonna take it off. Try to do it off camera. Uh, there we go. And uh, see, there's a, a scraper here. Here, it's uh, semi sharp. Um, you can uh, saw through things with it, and uh, it is uh, very nice steel. Uh, it's got a good edge to it as well, so uh, that's a lot of uses with this one. Um, there's a hidden blade in here. Um, anyway, uh, I'm gonna set up the camera so you can see, and I'm gonna process some wood. One way I do with uh, sticks is uh, take a hammer stone and bash them oh. <laughs> one handed. It's a bit uh, difficult. What that does is it separates the fibers and uh, it will give you uh, uh, nice small pieces uh, nicely broken up uh, exposing a lot of the fibers 
So uh, that is excellent uh, for small kindling. Uh, now onto the scraping. Using the stone as a uh, tripod. Okay, I'm gonna take a new one that isn't broken. get a lot of very fine fibers this way and uh, that is key to getting a fire now it's blowing away but I'm gonna do it off camera but it's just to show uh, what can be done with the present just want to show the fuss I got out of this one uh, very fine fibers. I'm gonna make uh, some more of it and uh, get, we'll get a fire going. <laughs> uh, the scraper worked so well so I forgot about uh, the huge twine. So just uh, take it out like this and uh, it's easy to replace. You can uh, bend a uh, wire hoop. Uh, have the uh, uh, U-twine go over the hoop and you can thread it through so very easy to replace so it's gonna take a fair bit of off and uh, if you're wondering how, how will I get it off well just back it up on yourself and uh, cut it off like that, easy piece. So, uh, when you want ignition from uh, U twine, it's very important to break it up into its different fibers. The more surface area, the more air can get to it, and the hotter it can burn. Simple physics. So, uh, I'm not gonna make a permanent fire, I'm just gonna. Uh, make a proof of concept. After using it for uh, prepping uh, the materials I'm, I'm very very uh, pleased with the uh, scraper. It uh, really helps out. Um, you can use rocks and all of that of course but uh, it's great to have a bit sharper tool than most rocks uh, untreated. You might not, not be able to find shirt or flint or anything in your area. So let's strike. Have to be pretty heavy on the striking. Let's see. This is of course the most important thing with a bracelet. I got one good there. Change camera angle. So steady. Use it camera as a wind block. There we go. So 
got the ignition and uh, it went out uh, hard to do it when filming so gonna make another try uh, it works of course but uh, so it works uh, very well and uh, depending on how, how well it works is uh, also down to your skill level so practice 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 and uh, as I said before you can replace the ute and you can add ute to it as well and uh, if anyone want to see a video on that just let me know so uh, this is all for today light is fading fast and uh, Gonna make a quick brew on my alcohol stove and uh, get back home. Thank you for watching and see you in the next one.